Wall Street rallied for a second straight day Tuesday after a weaker-than-expected report on the labor market lifted investor hopes that the Federal Reserve might temper its aggressive stance on raising interest rates. The Dow rose 2.8 percent, the S&P 500 climbed 3 percent, the index's biggest single-day rally in two years, while the Nasdaq jumped 3 and a third percent. A closely watched measure of labor demand known as the Jobs Openings and Labor Turnover Survey, or JOLTS, report showed U.S. job openings fell by the most in nearly two and a half years in August. Dan Wontrobsky, technical strategist at Janney Montgomery Scott, said that suggested the hot labor market was starting to cool, which could potentially lead the Fed to pull back on its aggressive plan to slow the economy to fight inflation. JOLTS coming in really, I think, much weaker than anticipated. And I think that is giving traders and investors reason to believe that perhaps uh, we are seeing signs of peak inflation behind us, that the economy is starting to cool as the Fed intends to see, uh, and therefore the Fed may become uh, more accommodative uh, in terms of its recent aggressive stance on fighting inflation. Rate-sensitive tech stocks rose with Apple, Microsoft, and Amazon leading Tuesday's rally as yields on the benchmark 10-year Treasury fell for a second day in a row. Shares of Twitter soared more than 22 percent after sources said billionaire Elon Musk proposed going ahead with his original offer to buy the social media company for $44 billion. Shares of Tesla had been up about 6 percent before the news of the CEO's proposal and immediately cut gains ending less than 3% higher amid the broad rally.